Hello native users, parents who are watching official YouTube channel of Shiva Learning. You all can also visit us on www.shivalearning.in for more details, okay? Or just search in Google Shiva Learning, you will get all the details about the counseling ETC, okay? So this is the video about Kerala need counseling. I will cover all the private colleges of Kerala, all the government colleges of Kerala, all the dental colleges, all the dental government colleges, what is the marks required to get admitted in the uh, in this year for the government colleges and the list of government colleges, dental and what are the admissions process, uh, what is admission procedure, okay and many other details I will explain in this video. So I will request all of you to watch the video till last and, and this video is also going to be beneficial for all the students who are either from the, either from Kerala domicile or they are from other states who want to apply for apply in Kerala, okay? So let me tell one thing that the Kerala registration is already over. I mean to say the registrations of Kerala is already over. Okay, now the now only the uh, only the counseling will start after the results, okay? So let's see uh, let's see from basic, okay? So uh, whatever the uh, students or the parents who are watching first time the new to the channel then don't then don't forget to subscribe us because we are going to update lots of important things okay at the time of the counseling okay so you'll get all the details from here okay so uh, let's see so the kerala so the kerala is an open state okay so other state students can also apply for the counseling the fees is still 6 to 7 lakh okay the last year they uh, and, and and last year there is a cases to increase the fees but still the fees is only six to seven lakh per annum and fees did not increase okay and the cutoff for the general and obc for the domicile students is 447 and for all other category okay it is 366 plus only for the domicile students okay and for other other state student the marks required is minimum of 510 minimum this is minimum 510 okay and uh, normally easy to get the colleges in city uh, you required minimum 540 marks 540 550 marks is required to get admitted here okay and uh, now let's see about the kerala private colleges and the fees structure so again i'm telling still the date is not announced for the counseling but the registration is over what i'm telling registration is over but the date is not announced for the counseling when the result will come you will have to again open the same page of registration and you, you have to update your marks there okay whatever rank or marks you will get you have to update in the KIM counseling website okay so the kerala private colleges and the fees structure first one is the kmct the fees is given here okay i am not going to tell the fees structure of these colleges because the fees is approximately 6 to 6.5 lakh 6.7 lakh per annum so, uh, KM City, Puspagri, Amla, Jubilee Missions, Malankara, SUT, Mount Zion, Chavankor, and PK Das, and DM, and then Sri Narayan Institute of Medical Science, SR Medical College, Believers Church, and then Dr. Somberwell, Malabar, Ajizia, Ayalajar, Sri Gokulam, Kanachur, MES, Corona, and Academy of Medical Science, Priyaram. Okay. So, these are the colleges are there with the fees structure is there. Let me see about the dental colleges. Okay. The tuition for the uh, and the tuition fee for the BDS in the all dental colleges have been fixed, which is approximately 3.04 lakhs, and 85% seat at 6 lakh per annum. And for and for the NRI seat, whatever the NRI seat are there, okay, where the fees is 6 lakh per annum. For MBBS for NRI seat, what I'm trying what I'm trying to say here, for MBBS MBBS NRI seat. Fees is equal to 20 lakhs per annum. Okay. And for BDS and RI seat, fees is equal to 6 lakh per annum. Okay. But no one no one is used to take the BZ, BDS seat in Kerala with a fees of 6 lakh per annum because there are a lot of BDS seats are there anywhere in India with a fees of 2.5 lakhs per annum. Okay. So these are the colleges like Anur, Edukair, Malabar. Okay. Marvish Lias, Nuram, PSM, Sri Ananjaya, Elajar, Ajijia, Indra Gandhi, Royal, MES, KM City, and Gokulam Kanachu Center International Institute of Dental Science, CTC. Let's see what are the cutoff for this year. It will come for this year for the government colleges. This I'm telling for the 85% quota. Again, I'm telling this is 85% quota. So for general category, it is 588. For obesity, OBC category, 567. It will go approx. And for EWS 570, for SC category 450 plus, for ST category 390, this is for 85% quota. I am not telling for the All India quota 15% for the Kerala state, okay. 
let's see what are the government colleges is available so for the so first one is the alptd and then cmc government kkm government klm knm ktm mlp pkm tcm and tvm these are the colleges with the locations are given here these are the government colleges okay and government dental colleges ltt government dental college kkd knd ktc and tcd and tvt government dental colleges and the locations is given here given here so these are the government dental colleges and let's see what are the eligibility criteria so i don't want to explain because the students already did the registrations okay so first one is the native students and the second one is the non kerala nk1 and nk2 or the students are there okay so these are the criteria okay so you already fill the form so i think you know very well about this uh, eligibility okay and the non keralaite students are also and the non domicile students holders of kerala who have studied kerala based school from 8 to class 12 okay education qualification is given kerala mbbs admissions application profit this is also already done so i don't want to explain about this one and the reservation criteria and the state merit list is given there i mean to say reservations are given there okay you can check the reservations here and then uh, uh, let's see for the other kerala mbbs admission process selections okay so so the registration is there which you already did and then uh, lots of things are there like fees payment etc registration fees is only 500 which already everyone completed okay and then rank list publication and then your central is allotment process will come and then your allotment and then reporting to the college okay let's see the number of seats so these are the number of seats in the colleges like amla okay amrita gg itc so these are the number of seats in the colleges i mean to say number of mbbs seats in the colleges okay including government and private like jubilee mission sunday seats are there okay and uh, and and you have one one more college which is pk das 150 seats are there okay and cut off uh, are required okay so this is the cut off marks okay which is from 2019 this is from 2019 okay last year data is still not available but i will update it soon jab bhi hame time milta hai i will update about the last year's details okay so this is from 2019 detail so here rank is given marks is given rank is given marks is given you can check from here okay and then kerala mbbs admission what are the documents is required okay so what are the documents is required like uh, neat neat uj admit card kerala cec tel admit letter class 10 marks it class 12 marks it fee is paid a fee is it paid at the time of registration date of birth graduation degree transfer certificate domicile certificate migration certificate courtesy and category certificate these are the documents required and these are the other courses which is out of the need okay so only only through the need this is there and remaining i am not going to explain which is not important for you people okay so thank you for watching guys uh, our main focus uh, in this video is just to explain about the private colleges and with their fees structure okay and this is also the open state so uh, open state means other state students can also easily apply for the counseling ctc so thank you for watching and uh, hope you'll do better in your counseling okay thank you